My name is Fiona Sampson and I'm the trail lawyer in residence. I'm a graduate of the Frost Centre at uh, Trent University. I graduated with my Master's in Canadian Heritage and Development Studies a long time ago, but um, uh, but I'm also a, uh, an honorary doctorate holder and I'm so thrilled to be back on campus. Just, uh, such a heart and soul experience being back here. So I think the idea of learning um, at Trent was uh, was really critical to how I've come to use law as a tool for social change because at Trent I learned to think critically but also to um, to really take theory and apply theory in a practical way. So, um, so the work that I do through the Equality Effect and the human rights work that I do in support of advancing um, legal change for uh, for women and girls is grounded in theory and the legal strategies that we develop as, uh, as a team of the Equality Effect are, um, are definitely uh, foundational in terms of uh, legal feminist theory, but, uh, but they're all directed towards achieving concrete change and, um, and that's something that was, uh, was really invaluable that I learned to Trent for sure. I think what, um, what students might, uh, might appreciate from my experience is an alternative career path. I, um, I did not take the, um, the straight and narrow path in terms of uh, social justice and law. It, um, it has definitely been a, uh, an alternative, creative and innovative path with, um, with some wrinkles, but with tons of rewarding uh, results. And so, um, so I think, you know, they think they might have, um, I hope, some, um, some interest in, in learning about that kind of alternative experience. I was pretty angry, and I still am pretty angry about the injustice in the world and about the, um, the lack of social justice for people who experience vulnerabilities and disadvantage. And uh, I think that, um, using the law as a tool for change has um, has been effective in lots of circumstances and I've been fortunate to be part of teams that have achieved change and that's been rewarding but it it is an uphill battle and there are lots of um, lots of uh, defeats along the way and that just makes me more <laughs> angry and uh, and it fires me up and uh, and it I think makes it a um, uh, it makes it an experience that's a little bit like being in love it is all consuming and it never feels like work but um, but it uh, it was definitely a passion that was um, it was, I think, uh, inherent in, in my experience, but, um, but using the law as a tool for change has definitely, um, definitely made me more passionate, I guess it's a polite way to say, fired up and angry. <laughs> so something I think maybe that I wish I had, uh, I had heard or learned when, um, when I was still in the, uh, the early stages of, uh, of learning, which I would say I'm definitely still learning all these years later, is, um, is maybe to embrace discomfort. And I think I, uh, I got exposed to, um, to challenges and to discomfort and to, um, to the unknown. And, and that definitely happened at Trent. And I had my comfort zone pushed and I had amazing professors who provided that push and had confidence and faith and limitless uh, support to offer me. And through that, I, um, I kind of, I jumped into situations and took on opportunities that, um, that I, I was really uh, like kind of naive, maybe in some sense, but also um, like they changed my lives. Those, those opportunities and maybe if somebody had told me that that embracing that discomfort would be a positive it might have might have been beneficial but I don't know at the same time I think it um, you know the exploring the unknown and and benefiting from you know from the 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 discomfort and uh, and embracing that discomfort has all been positive so so maybe that's something that, uh, that I would have benefited from, but at the same time, I feel like I just had such a, uh, such a positive experience at Trent, and I feel like it's enriched my life so much, I can't, I can't say that I regret not knowing that. <laughs>
Yeah, so being back at Trent is a, um, you know, it's an amazingly positive experience, but um, but really emotional at the same time. I had such a, um, such a, uh, a sort of born again experience here coming out as a, um, as a underconfident undergrad when I arrived and being empowered by the profs and the, um, the peers that I worked with here as graduate students at um, it was foundational for me. So, uh, so being back here is, um, you know, it sounds like a cliche, but it's like coming home.